what's up collective it's me the fly empress and welcome back to my channel you guys so i'm here to do another general reading this reading will be for december the 29th to december the 30th and this reading will not resonate with everyone so take what resonate with you and leave the rest behind okay you guys let's go ahead and jump into these messages and let's see what spirit wants us to know for december the 29th to December the 30th, Divine Holy Spirit, show me what I need to see for my collective. If I can get these cards straight. I've been up all night doing readings, you guys. I've been trying to get y'all monthlies and stuff done for January. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the collective. What do they need to know for December the 29th to December the 30th, Spirit? Show me what I need to see for the collective. What's going on, Spirit, for the collective? Okay. All right, you guys. So, the first card we got out is Astro Travel. All right. This says you have the ability to separate your astral body from your physical self and travel to different dimensions. So, I'm definitely picking up for a lot of you guys. You have entered the 5D you pass some type of spiritual test here. I feel like your life is about to take off. Your spirit guides and your angels are around you, assisting you. But I'm definitely seeing you guys are going to a whole new world, all right? You're traveling. You're, um, you're moving um, through this portal that we've been talking about. I'm sure a lot of people in tarot land has been talking about the 5D. You guys, you're definitely ascending here. For some of you guys, you've already ascended. You're about to close the door on the past and you're about to walk into your new life. I feel like you're not taking nothing with you either. All right. This person got on a box. All right. You leaving the past behind. You're about to enter a whole new world, a whole new life for yourself. And we also got, we got Taurus energy coming up. This came out in reverse. Uh, for some of you, you might be a Taurus or you could be dealing with a Taurus here. But we got stubborn, jealous, lazy, materialistic, and possessive. All right, this is somebody who, um, this is somebody who's sought in their ways, you guys. I definitely feel like whoever this person is, they did not pass the spiritual test. This person is very stubborn and sought in their ways. This is also somebody who's very 3D. This is somebody who's very materialistic. The only thing that they care about is um, money, sex, drugs, alcohol. This is somebody who operate in a low frequency, okay? We also got the King of Swords coming out, you guys. All right. Um, you could be a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. You could be dealing with somebody who's an air sign, but I'm definitely picking up that somebody is wanting to come in and talk to you guys. Um, this card says structure, routine, detached, intelligent, logical power. I feel like somebody could have wanted control over this situation or somebody is not wanting for you to leave them behind as well. This person could be trying to make a last attempt to come into your life. Um, but I feel like for a lot of you guys, you're cutting, you're, you're cutting out the past. You're cutting this person off here. I feel like you guys are standing your ground. You're speaking your truth and you're seeing, um, the truth about this person, all right? This this is somebody who could have been trying to hold you guys back as well, but you see past the BS here. So let me see, y'all. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the collective for December the 29th to December the 30th. What do they need to know, Divine Holy Spirit? Show me what I need to see for the collective. What's the energy spirit for December the 29th to December the 30th? For the collective, show me what I need to see. Something could be going on regarding a house or somebody living situation. Somebody could have got kicked out of a house. Um... For some of you guys, you could be focusing on, on a house or you're focusing 
on moving okay i am picking up that for some of you you're going to be moving in the near future here but um I definitely feel like somebody from the past is thinking about you a lot. This person is wanting to come back into your life. It could be something going on with this person living situation as well. But I definitely feel like somebody got you heavily on their brain. It's like they're trying to figure out how to, um, I'm here and connect. Somebody is wanting to reconnect with you here. We also got the mature woman coming out in reverse. I feel like a, you, a lot of you guys, you don't walk away from this person. And this is why they're wanting to come in and talk to you. Because this person don't want you to get away. Okay. Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the collective. What do they need to know? Show me what I need to see, Spirit. For December the 29th to December the 30th. What do they need to know, Spirit? What's going on here? Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, so we got black sheep. All right, I feel like for a lot of you guys, um, and this card been coming out a lot lately. A lot of you guys, you could... You could have been viewed as the black sheep, but that's because spirit was was um hiding you from I'm hearing vultures. All right, people who um could have took advantage of you are you guys, you could have been vulnerable in the past. Spirit was hiding your light from these people. I feel like a lot of you guys, you are the I'm hearing golden child. All right, you are a star seed. You're very unique, you're different, okay? Um, for a lot of you guys, you're learning to tap into um, your true self. And I feel like you're going to have a lot of people that's wanting to come in and I'm here and visit you or talk to you. Or you're going to be attracting a lot of people towards you. And it's because you guys are shining. Okay. Um, a lot of people are seeing your light here. And I definitely feel like somebody in the past is looking at your light. Because we also got wishes, manifest, and dreams coming out in the reverse. Somebody feel like they done missed out, okay? Somebody feel like they done missed out on their dreams. Or this person feel like um, you, you was the gift and they didn't see your true value. They could have turned their back on you. And this person is realizing that they let you get away. There is somebody who's thinking about you guys a lot. This person is starting to feel sick because I'm actually seeing somebody who could feel sick at the stomach. I'm seeing someone laying on a couch, okay? And this person is thinking about you a lot. I'm also seeing someone um, look through their phones. They're looking at their messages or pictures of you as well. Um, and look at this, you guys. We got twin flame. So I definitely feel like um, this could be your divine masculine or your divine feminine. Um, I do feel like you guys have a strong connection with each other. But for a lot of you divine feminists, you don't walk away from this twin flame connection here. And we also got peacock and dignity. So, yeah, I feel like this person... Um, they didn't see your beauty. They didn't see your um, uniqueness. They didn't see, um, I'm hearing the power that you possess. For a lot of you guys, when you walked away from this situation, you put the work into yourself. Um, you put the work into whatever it was. You put the work into whatever it was that you was trying to create. But you walked away from this twin flame situation. And now somebody is looking back at you. Somebody is wanting to be back in your presence. Ooh. Yeah, we got passion and mystery. So I definitely feel like you guys, you have a lot of passion for whatever it is that you're doing. Okay, or whatever it is that you're about to do. Um, for some of you, it might be still a mystery of what you're meant to do in your life. But I definitely feel like um, spirit is about to reveal the truth to you. A lot of you are about to tap into your true self because this swan, it looks like she's looking in the water um, here. And then this came out on the black sheep. 
both of these animals are black. So I definitely pick up on some type of divine feminine here. For some of you, you are divine feminines here. And I feel like um, you walking in your power and you about to be blessed here. For some of you, this is what a home, okay? Because I see house here heavy. And yeah, we got yin and yang. I feel like a lot of you guys, you realize that you and this person are not on the same wavelength, okay? You're not in the same frequency. And you're choosing to pull back your energy from this person here. Spirit, a lot of you are realizing that this person is not balanced either, okay? And then we got I love you. This person is wanting to extend a love offer to you. This person is trying to figure out how they can get back into your heart space. But um, I feel like you guys are putting love and you're putting a lot of care in yourself and what it is that you want or what it is that you're trying to manifest. All right. Yeah, we got Ronnie here. This is definitely a divine masculine that we're talking about. This person is wanting to... Okay, so when I'm looking at this horse, it's not running towards the future. It's running back towards the past. This person is wanting to come after you, all right? I just heard the runner has become the chaser, okay? This person is wanting to come back into your life, but they're still full of passion. This is somebody who still haven't balanced um, their emotions yet. This is somebody who still need balance in their um, in their mental space as well. All right, I'm, I'm seeing the overall. This is somebody who needs to work on themselves. I do feel like this person is wanting to rush back into your life. Um, this person is wanting to come in um, and have passionate sex with you. I've been picking up this a lot, okay? Um, for some of them, they could feel like, you know, if they could just get you back in the bed, that everything will be okay. But we got Lady Slipper coming out in a reverse. I feel like you guys are no longer vulnerable. You used to be vulnerable vulnerable in the past, but I feel like y'all not no more. Okay. You done um you done grew a hard shell. Okay. You you learn how to protect your heart from people like this. And I feel like you guys know that this person right here. This person could be very flighty as well. A lot of you, you know that this is your twin flame. But I just heard the back of my hand. For a lot of you guys, you know this person like the back of your hand here. All right? You know this person, M.O. Yeah, we got fraud and trickster coming in in reverse. This person can't trick you no more. The mask has come off. People see the truth about this person. And you damn sure see the truth about this person here. We also got baggage coming in in a reverse. You're walking away from um, this person because they carry a lot of baggage, okay? And you don't want this. I feel like you guys, you don't release your baggage. You don't walk away from this. And you're focusing on yourself. You're focusing on um, this new beginning, okay? Spirit, show me what I need to see for the collective December the 29th. Yeah, you guys, you're leaving this behind. You're walking away. You don't left that dark period in your life. All right, you waiting for your plane. All right, that's what you waiting for. Y'all finna get ready to take the off. Spirit, show me what I need to see. <laughs> show me what I need to see for the collective. Ooh. Yeah, and this person, they feel bound right now. All right, this person feels stuck. This person, um could also feel bound to addictions, okay? Or this person, um, they can't escape this 3D world. A lot of you guys, you leaving this 3D world behind, okay? You astro traveling, you going to that next dimension, all right? You going to the 5D here. A lot of you guys, you learn how to guard your heart. You don't let anybody into your space no more. Because I feel like for a lot of you, you working on yourself. You working on a new beginning. Y'all taking time out to self-reflect over what it is that you need to work on you. All right, for a lot of you, I'm hearing self-love, self-care. All day, every day, baby. I don't blame you. This is what you guys are focusing on. And what brings you happiness. What brings you peace and joy. Spirit, show me what else is going on. Yeah, somebody is 
in their emotions, okay? Big time. This person is in their head. I feel like they can't relax. This person got you on their mind. This is somebody who's thinking about this situation a lot. This person could also be smoking a lot as well, all right? We also got new line of study. Um, researching occult things. A lot of you are reconnecting to your culture or you're learning something new. A lot of you guys are preparing yourself for this new beginning or um, you're focusing on a new life for yourself. I definitely see a lot of you guys um, diving into your spirituality, um, researching new things, learning new things, learning new cultures, okay? I see you guys ascending to a new level here. Spirit, what else? I just heard things won't be the same, you guys. We got meant to be. This relationship is magical. It's meant to be, okay? Um, And we also got rumors coming out in a reverse. So I do feel like this person is realizing that you guys was meant to be, especially if this is a twin flame relationship here this person could want to come in around new year's i do feel like they want to um bring in the new year's with you um but this person don't know how to get to you i feel like a lot of you guys have disconnected from this person i also feel like um somebody could have been spreading rumors about you all right but i feel like people don't believe this shit because a lot of people know who you are are these people see you and they like you know you lied this person ain't doing this and that. This person is doing good for themselves. So I do see that um, people who could have been talking about you is going to be admiring you. People who um, who they talk to about you, they're going to be looking at this person as if they are a liar here. I definitely see somebody is seeing through the fog, okay? Somebody's vision is getting clear here on what it is that they need to do. Spirit, what else? Yeah, somebody is realizing that they went the wrong way, all right? Somebody is realizing that they went the wrong way. This person was lost, all right, with all this damn fog here, and then it looked like they're in the desert. This is somebody who was lost, you guys. Yeah, we got lying coming in in reverse. And we also got transformation coming in in a reverse. A lot of them realize, you guys, that they have to or they need to go through this transformation. It could be very difficult for them at this time. But they also are realizing that they can't lie to you. That if they come to you, they're going to have to come to you with the truth. Because y'all can see, y'all can see past all this bullshit here. All right? And I do feel like a lot of you guys know that this person haven't went through their transformation. And that's why you're pulling back your energy because it's time for you to go. I just heard, um, I got to leave, but I got to go right now. I don't know who's saying that song. I'll be back to hold you down. So this person is realizing that they do need to go on this transformation here. But they're going to have to go within and work on themselves first before they're able to come back into your life. So let me see, y'all. I'm going to pull a trinket spirit. Show me what I need to see for the collective. December the 29th to December the 30th. What do they need to know, spirit? Show me what I need to see. Uh -huh. Look at this, you guys. So we got Africa. All right. Um, I definitely feel like for um, the African-American descent, you guys, you need to make sure you're reconnecting with your roots, reconnect with your culture here as well. Um, I'm also hearing ground yourself, and I'm also hearing the tree of life, you guys. Um, spirit is trying to get us to, I'm hearing, go back to the old ways or the ancient ways when they use herbs as medicine they use herbs as food they they ate living things they ate from the tree of life they took time out to worship um the most high they took time out to honor their ancestors i do feel like you guys are going to be doing some research here okay um we also got the crowds 
So I definitely feel like spirit is wanting you guys to reconnect with your true self here. I do feel like you guys are being protected as well. Um, your angels and your spirit guys are really protecting you guys at this time. And they're also trying to help this um, runner here or this person that has been wreaking havoc in your life. Shit, I feel like they've been wreaking havoc in their own life. Their an angels and ancestors is trying to help them at this time, you guys. All right. Yeah, look at this. Where is it, y'all? Oh, look at this. Look, look. Divine Masculine, this is a reading for you, okay? You need to reconnect. You need to stop this damn running, okay? You need to put the work in yourself. This is definitely for some Divine Masculine out here that could feel lost at this time. It's time to work on you and slow the fuck down. Stop running. I just heard, keep running, running, and running, running, and yeah, yeah, this is the key. Spirit is trying to give you the key. If you want this new life, you need to do the work, okay? I've been getting the key a lot, you guys. Spirit is really trying to connect with you all, all right? But you have to want to connect with spirit. Spirit can help you, Divine Masculine, if you're not trying to connect, okay? Take the time out and connect and get out of your head. Yes, you guys. So, y'all, if y'all like these messages, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring that notification bell. And until we see each other later, I love you guys so much. Peace.